Denicio Lanca was an Argentinian truck driver who was allegedly abducted by aliens in the 1970s. He was on his way to deliver construction materials to a nearby town. Around midnight, he made an unexpected stop. That's when he encountered three alien humanoids that took him into their spaceship. Even though he initially had no recollection of the incident, after a couple of days, he was able to remember everything while under hypnosis. On October 27, 1973, around 12.30 a.m., Denicio got into his truck, fully loaded with construction materials he had to deliver to a nearby town. On the way there, he had to stop to fix a flat tire. Around 1.15 a.m., while he was changing the tire in complete darkness, the road got illuminated by an intense yellow light. At first Denicio thought it was another vehicle's headlights, but the light quickly intensified and changed to an electric bluish color. He tried to get up, but his legs didn't respond. Then he noticed a saucer-shaped object floating about 23 feet up in the air. At this point he noticed three blonde humanoids standing nearby, staring at him. He concluded that there were two males and a female based on details of their anatomy revealed by the skin-tight suits they were wearing. Their faces were human-like with elongated eyes. On Sunday around 3 a.m. Denicio woke up approximately 5.5 miles from where he met the strange humanoids. He couldn't remember what happened to him, he was disoriented, walking on the side of a road when a driver pulled over and picked him up. By October 30th, under the care of doctors he made a full recovery. After his abduction, Denicio was suffering constant nightmares, so he decided to go see a psychiatrist. A group of experts led by his psychiatrist, performed several tests on him. While hypnotized and under the influence of the truth serum pentothal, Denicio described his abduction in detail. He indicated that the aliens used a light beam to bring him aboard their spaceship. He described the aircraft in detail, he claimed that the beings collected several more samples from him. He also remembered a door malfunctioning and several cables going loose from the cockpit and landing on a high-voltage power line located in the vicinity of the craft. After they were done with him, the aliens left Denicio near the place where he was later found. The case caught the attention of Argentinian UFO researcher Fabio Zerpa. He and his team conducted their own investigation into the case. They found out that an energy pylon had been damaged. They were also able to corroborate with the power company some anomalies in electricity consumption in the area where the abduction happened, verifying Mr. Lanka's story. Mr. Lanka's description of the aliens sounds very much like they were humans, perhaps they were not aliens at all but time travelers from Earth. What do you think about Denicio's alien abduction? Do you agree with us on the possible origins of the beings? Or do you think they were indeed visitors from another planet?